So I just heard a little bit of chatter today. I use this tool called Descript for editing our videos, but I use it in conjunction with StreamYard, where usually I'm not recording online and streaming live. I'm usually recording offline and then taking that video and moving it into Descript. As of today, I log into Descript and I see a note that says, hey, we just bought Squadcast. And so now they're gonna have remote recording and editing all in one place. Their goal is to integrate these two. So the goal is to take it where you have video remote editing if you're doing like a video podcast and where some people are using maybe something like Zoom, but Squadcast is one of those tools. And then what would happen is they would record and then input that information into the script. So by buying Squadcast, they're putting the two together and eventually they're going to integrate it directly into Descript where you'll be able to record directly into Descript and then edit straight from there. Now for me the big question is am I going to be getting rid of StreamYard due to this new process and I don't know the answer there due to all of the features that StreamYard actually has. Even though I'm using it to record offline, it's really cool with the overlays and how I'm able to produce a show live almost by bringing in images, by playing video clips and music. I can do this during the production of the video that I'm working on. So I'm not sure what's gonna happen, but definitely interesting news, so I wanted to bring it up, to, bring it to your attention. I have some other videos that I've made. I am an active user of Descript currently. I'm an active user of StreamYard. If you go to brooksconkle.com forward slash tools, those are on the list of tools that I use to run and operate my business. You can see my thoughts on them. I'll also put that down in the description. But Squadcast, I'd love to hear from you guys. If you've used Squadcast, let me know what do you think that I'll be able to combine the two tools together or am I going to still be using them separately and maybe just using Squadcast for the remote interview recording type 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 projects that I do. All right, looking forward to see how this goes. Way to go, Descript. Good job.